G'day YouTube, down to bricks here. What you building? Well I'm back with the Cape Crusader with the Kryptonite Interception. Set 76045, of course it's a 2016 set, has 306 pieces and comes with three minifigs. We have a couple of LexCorp goons flanking Batman here. We get some very nice jacket prints on these goons with the LexCorp badge. I like the use of some newer face prints we've been getting and hair pieces as well. But the star of the show is, of course, Batman. So we get some very nice torso printing on Batman. I like that new print. The dual molded legs with the black boots. I really like that as well. Again, we're getting the soft cape and just to have a better look at that face print. And on the back of the torsos, we get the Lex Corp logo and we get some very nice detail on Batman as well with his old face. So we're going to start with this deadly little build. I love a little forklift build and I like this one so much. I'm even going to put it in the city, but let's have a look at what we can do with it. So of course you can lower the tines, pick up your cargo of kryptonite and off you go. The kryptonite pieces are very cool and they're easy to get into just by lifting the clear cover off. So the back of the forklift you have a little tab there and that's so you can explode the cab straight off. And we know how much Lego love their flick fire, so we get flick fire headlights. But on to the main show, we have the Batmobile. And I mean, it's just sweet, isn't it? Have a look at this. It is one mean looking Batmobile. That front cockpit piece, have a look at that. Of course, it splits in two and lifts up. At the back here, you have an assortment of adjustments. Behind the front wheels, we've got some wicked looking cannons and you can adjust them up and down. And just to show in the cockpit, that's just a couple of stickers you've got in there. And Batman fits in there very snug. And from the front, it looks pretty mean. We are missing some coverage on the front wheel arches there. But I don't mind that so much. We get the stud shooters at the front. And it even looks pretty decent from the back. And just a straight on side shot. And just to have a look at the angle of that new cockpit piece. My hope would be to one day that we might actually get a molded one with no studs. And that would be very sleek. Of course it's Lego and what's Lego without studs. But just to get a nice smooth finish on that piece would make it very handy for other mock builds. Now it wouldn't be a Batmobile review without a comparison. So let's grab one of many that LEGO have produced in the past. So here we have it with last year's Batmobile from the Jokerland set 76035. And I really like that Batmobile as well. And they look sweet together. I mean they are so different looking but they both look awesome and going into this I was thinking that I'd probably actually lean towards the kryptonite intercept interception Batmobile but looking at them here it is a very very tough choice and I'm gonna call it even Stevens because I can't pick I'm gonna leave it up to you guys to tell me what you like best out of these two but either way, you're going to swing. I think LEGO have produced two great looking LEGO Batmobiles here. And you can't go wrong with this new Kryptonite Interception set. Now, I think I might have missed at the start the price you're going to pay for this set. So it's £30, 30 bucks in the US, 35 euros, and it's 50 bucks in Australia. But you can pick it up at the department stores for a little less. And I think I paid 44 bucks for this one here. Well, now that we've checked out everything that this set has to offer, I have to say I am very impressed. I love it. I love this Batmobile. What really does it for me is the new windscreen cockpit piece. I love that sleek design of it, the low profile. I just reckon it is a mean-looking Batmobile. 
I also like that it's something quite different to what we've got in the past as well, so I'm really looking forward to seeing it, how it looks in the movie. As for minifigs, I mean the goons have got some pretty good detail on them. They look pretty sweet. The forklift is a great little build. You always have so much fun with a forklift. The kryptonite pieces are very cool. The Batman is an awesome print with the dual molded legs. But the Batmobile steals the show and that is an awesome looking set. So it gets my thumbs up big time this set. I really, really enjoyed it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, but I would love to hear from you, so leave it all in the comments. While you're there, give the thumbs up for the video, that would be sweet. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you want to stay up to date with all my LEGO videos. But I thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you again real soon with another Batman set. See you then.